Hey everyone, welcome back to another episode of Inside the Box, where I open up the latest ASUS hardware and show you what's inside. Today we'll be taking a look at the Tough Gaming Z590 Plus Wi-Fi motherboard. This durable and tough board is a great fit for your next Intel gaming PC, and I'm going to take you inside the box. The Tough Gaming Z590 Plus Wi-Fi is engineered with military-grade components, an upgraded power solution, and a comprehensive cooling solution to provide rock-solid, stable performance for marathon gaming. Now, one of the first things you'll notice on the box is that this is the first motherboard to sport the newly redesigned Tough Gaming badge. Now, I'm a fan of the new logo as it feels very in line with the military aesthetic of the rest of the Tough line. Now, whether you're looking to build a new 10th Gen Intel PC now, or are planning an 11th gen Intel build later in the year, the Tough Gaming Z590 Plus Wi-Fi is going to be a solid choice. Now let's open it up, see what's inside. The first thing we find here is the 2x2 dual band Wi-Fi 6 antenna. This is great for setups where you can't run an ethernet cable. Next is the motherboard itself. We'll go ahead and pull off the bag here. That is a beautiful board. Go ahead and set it aside for the moment. Underneath, we're going to find our user guide, a certificate of reliability, a set of great tough gaming stickers, and your software, and a few other essentials for your build. This full ATX motherboard has a military-esque black and gray color scheme with yellow accents that are a staple of the Tough series. The two-tone black aluminum heat sinks give it a sleek yet rugged feel. You can see the new Tough Gaming badge prominently displayed on the extra-large VRM heat sink as well as the IO shroud and audio cover. On the back panel you'll find a host of connectivity options including six USB type A ports and one type C port. And if you need more, there are internal connectors for up to seven more USB ports, including one Thunderbolt 4 header. Now, the integrated stainless steel I.O. shield is always a favorite feature of mine, as it prevents the headaches that are caused when you forget to install it. There is one PCIe 4.0x16 slot, one PCIe 3.0x16 slot, and a pair of PCIe 3.0x1 slots for your GPU and add-on cards. You can see the reinforced PCIe 4.0 slot, which uses our safe slot design for better retention and shearing resistance. For power delivery, the Tough Gaming Z590 Plus Wi-Fi uses 14 plus 2 DRMOS power stages to keep up with the latest Intel CPUs. The board supports a total of three M.2 drives, including one PCIe 4.0x4 slot for ultra-fast NVMe drives. In addition to the large heat sinks that you can see, there are a series of high-quality thermal pads and several fan connectors that you can control through our Expert 4 fan utility. To connect you with the world, this board features onboard Intel Wi-Fi 6 for blazing fast wireless speeds and 2.5 gigabit ethernet with tough LandGuard and TurboLand technology. The Realtek S1200A codec offers pristine audio quality to draw you deeper into the game, while the ASUS AI noise canceling mic technology keeps your comms crystal clear. The Tough Gaming Z590 Plus Wi-Fi is currently available in stores, so check below for links on where you can buy it. If you're still not sure which motherboard is right for your next 10th or 11th gen Intel build, then be sure to check out the ROG Maximus 13 Hero, ROG Strix Z590-E Gaming Wi-Fi, and the ASUS Prime Z590-A.
Hey everyone, I'm Chris, and as you know, here at ASUS we make a lot of amazing hardware, and I want to give you a first look at some of our newly released products and what you can expect to find when you open them up. Now to kick things off, we're starting with the official unboxing of the ROG Maximus 13 Hero. This AI-powered board is the perfect fit for your next Intel gaming PC, and I'm going to take you inside the box. You can call the Maximus 13 Hero an AI motherboard. Why? Well, it utilizes AI to assist with overclocking, cooling, and networking to ensure the best possible system performance. Plus, our AI noise canceling technology keeps your comms free of distracting sounds and background noise. Now, let's open it up and see what's inside. The Maximus 13 Hero was built for the latest 11th gen Intel CPUs, but accepts 10th gen Intel processors for maximum compatibility. Now the motherboard's the most obvious thing that you're gonna expect in the box, but we're gonna go ahead and get that out of the way for the moment. Underneath here, we're gonna find our quick start user guide, software, and some great stickers to show your allegiance. And underneath here are the rest of our goodies. Now we're gonna find a set of M.2 screws. This, if we open it up, is our two by two Wi-Fi antenna. It's got a magnetic base so it can attach to your case securely and the antenna moves to four different positions for the best possible Wi-Fi coverage. Inside here is our GPU mounting bracket. Now this is gonna help keep your GPU standing up straight no matter how heavy it is. And then we've also got our regular assortment of cables that you're gonna need for your build. Finally, there's a sweet ROG keychain that's gonna help you show off your allegiance no matter where you are. This full ATX motherboard has a beautiful black and gray look with the VRM heat sinks, M.2 heat sinks, and L-shaped heat pipe bringing sharp angles and straight lines to the design. Both the chipset heat sink and I.O. panel cover feature AuraSync RGB lighting that can be synced with the rest of your battle station. You can control additional lighting with the included addressable RGB headers over here. The integrated aluminum I.O. shield is always a favorite feature of mine, as it prevents headaches that can be caused when you forget to install it. The board supports a total of four M.2 drives, including two PCIe 4.0 x 4 slots for ultra-fast NVMe drives. For power delivery, the Maximus 13 Hero uses 14 plus 2 teamed power stages that are rated for 90 amps and feature ProCool 2 power connectors with a solid core pin design. If you can't get an Ethernet cable to your battle station, the Maximus 13 Hero still has you covered with Wi-Fi 6E on board. The dual antenna controller supports 2.4, 5, and 6 GHz bands to ensure that you get the fastest speeds possible in your environment. You can see the long heatsink covering the ROG Supreme FX ALC4082, which, when paired with the integrated Sabre DAC, provides crystal clear output no matter what you're listening to. The ROG Maximus 13 Hero is currently available in stores, so check below for links on where to buy it. Then, pair it with the new ROG Rapture GT AXE 11000 router for the fastest networking speeds and the world's first 6GHz wireless ecosystem. Oh.